Hey guys, today I'm here with a vlogger PR haul. So I'm just going to be showing you things that companies have sent me, so new release products and things like that that I get in the mail. First one that I've got here is my absolute favorite. <sighs> I just can't even with this. Like this is an actual legit suitcase. Flashback to, you know, like your eight year old girly self. I would have just died. And I did die when I opened this up, but like this suitcase is just amazing. It's what girls dream of kind of thing. And it's a legit suitcase with a lock and everything. Like you just need to, yeah. It's really cool. In it are all of the new brow products. So I'm not sure if you guys were familiar, but I'll, they flew a lot of vloggers to Vegas. They gave them all these brow products to play with and they set up, oh, it was just amazing. Like I saw it happen in people's vlogs and on Snapchat and it was so awesome. So I was so just blown away when I got this in the mail, like let alone the suitcase, but the products as well. I'm yet to try any of them because I've left this haul for you guys. There are nine products here to do with brows. Now they've given me the color three. Number three is medium. So that should be about right for me. There's this whole big booklet to do with these products and how you use them and everything like that. So we have the brow conditioning primer to be used before any brow products. We have the Gimme Brow. If you haven't used this before, it's just a little mascara for your brows, which adds color and it sets your brows as well. We have Ready Set Brow, which is just a clear brow gel, I think. We have the Goof Proof, Goof? Proof Brow Pencil, which has like an angular tip and it looks very easy to apply. We have precisely my brow pencil. I think that this is similar to the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz and products like those. The Car Brow, which is a brow pomade. High Brow Pencil, now they have reformulated this one. So it's a creamy brow highlighting pencil. Pretty Browtons, I think that's how you say it. Brow tones, brow tones. Subtle Brow Enhancing Highlights. And then the browsings, which is a powder and a wax. So I cannot wait to try all of these products. I don't know how I'm gonna even work my way through them. Like honestly, I will never need another brow product ever. <laughs> Thank you so much, Benefit. I cannot wait to try this out and I love my suitcase. It's so freaking cute. Next up, I have something from Exo Beauty. It is the Putty Stack Lash Set. So we have five pairs of lashes, the Hero, the Wild One, the Sinner, the Brave, and the Rebel. And they are all dramatic and so, so beautiful. I. I cannot wait to use these. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of Shannon. These look so, so good. The party stack, guys, get on it. I actually just picked this one up today. This is from Mecca Maxima. I have the new Hourglass Vanish Foundation, which is exclusive at Mecca. So I have three shades and a brush. I have Nude, Shell, and Warm Beige. The packaging of the foundation looks like this. It's so weird saying a foundation because it doesn't look like a foundation. Like the packaging is so unique. It is a stick foundation and then it comes out in a triangle. Very excited to try this one out. I think I'll do a first impressions on it tomorrow maybe. This one does come out August 23rd. So stay tuned on my channel for a first impressions on this one. I also did receive the brush to apply it with and this brush, oh my gosh, it's so soft and so dense. I am very excited to try this out. Like it feels so good. Thanks so much Jess at Mecca, you are amazing. <laughs> I got this package from L'Oreal yesterday and it's so cool. It's such a big box. It says sculpt your look. I recently went to a L'Oreal event where they showed all of the new releases coming out in the end of 2016. But here, if you open it up, you have two sculpting powders, which are kind of, they're a cream to powder formula. I haven't used them yet, but they seem so, so awesome. And we've got a little brush here that says crystal. And then we've got two of the new blushes. And then, dun 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 dun. We have another drawer of goodies. So we have the infallible mattifying mist. Now this you need to be careful with. You need to shake so, so much before you apply it on your face. It can leave some residue on your face. So to be careful of that, we have the false wing lash effect sculpt mascara. And then we have the two brow artist sculpt 
little mascara gel things. I don't know what they're called, but they're basically like a brow mascara, but uh, they also have a tip as well. So you can like fill it in and then use a mascara over the top. So it's kind of like a two in one product. So this is all of their sculpting range coming out. This should be in stores now. If you wanted to go and take a look at all of their new range. Thanks so much for that L'Oreal. I have a package from Viv at the Heat Group and I think I have a few other packages from her actually. This one here is from Ulta and I don't know about you guys but Ulta for me is a little bit hard to find. You can only find it in selected pharmacies. I think like Terry White pharmacies. They have really really affordable products. I got this PR package which is Face by Elise Knowles Glow by Ulta 3. So it's all about their glowing products and strobing products. So I have the Ready to Go Illuminating Primer which is $8.95. I have the Cover It Conceal Duo $5.95. These look so good. I was so impressed when opening these. I have the light medium and then the medium dark. The light medium has a really nice salmon shade which is perfect for covering the dark circles underneath your eyes but they are such a great price. Hopefully they don't cake up or anything like that. Yeah such a good little size as well. Then we have the Perfect Your Glow strobing kit. This one's $14.95. So it looks like you get two creams and then four powders. So I don't know if like strobing is still in but they might have it might have actually taken them that long to just get the product made. I know products for some companies can take like a year or so turnaround time in making it. This would be perfect if you're after that strobing look instead of the contouring look because we have different varieties of creams, powders and different shades as well. But yeah, they're the new goodies from Ulta 3 if you wanted to go check them out and um, see if they're in your local pharmacy. Also from Viv, I have a whole heap of essence goodies. Okay, so in my little essence bag, I have quite a few things. I have a velvet matte lipstick in number 23 which is a really beautiful nude that is right up my alley. Love it. We have two new mascaras here. So we have Forbidden Volume Top Coat and Forbidden Volume Mascara. So I guess using them together will give you a lot and lots of volume. Something that I'm really excited about is this Soft Touch Mousse Concealer in Soft Beige. My good friend Shanae actually tried it and she said it's really, really good. So I'm very excited to try that. It comes in a little pot, which is really cute. Here we have the Essence Color and Care Strength nail polish in a really cute light pink color. It's called O2 I Care For You and it actually says that it's made with natural ingredients which is very interesting. I think that the color is really nice as well because sometimes with like deeper or brighter nail polishes they when they chip or come off you just take it all off but this you could maybe just touch up because it is such a nice light wash of pink. And two more nail polishes so we have the Essence the Gel Polish in the darks. This is 58 Need Your Love and it actually kind of matches my lipstick, doesn't it? <laughs> and then we have this, the Metals in 34 Turn Up The Volume, which is very interesting. It's pink and then it's got swirls of silver in it. Yeah, that's really awesome. <laughs> I have an Essence Super Fine Eyeliner Pen Waterproof. I really, really hope this one works. I did an Essence makeup tutorial and I used one of these and it had completely dried out. Like I tried storing it upside down and there was nothing there like it just never there was nothing there I don't know how it was dried out or why but I hope that this one I can restore my faith <laughs> then we have another velvet matte lipstick in number 24 oh my gosh that is so pretty it's a beautiful berry color we have the essence my heart is beating like a jungle drum exit to explore blush this is like one of their new collections oh it's a really pretty ombre brush why do I say brush when I mean blush? Really pretty ombre blush that is so stunning. I love it. I have these little tattoos as well. I did get an eyeshadow but it actually smashed in the post and I was so sad. It was a really nice like khaki forest green kind of color. Now this is interesting. This is called the Bloggers Beauty Secrets palette. This is Vintage Rose. From what I've read, they had a few bloggers work with Essence to create these palettes. So I think that there's a few of them. It comes with a really good range of eyeshadows actually. I wonder what the pigment is like. Ooh, the pigment is actually quite nice. So yeah, I might actually do another Essence One brand tutorial soon. Let me know if you'd like to see another one. Here I have an Exit to Explore Refreshing Lipstick in Pink Parrot. Wow, that is as pink as it is. Wow. That's a different concept for a, a lipstick for Essence. I don't think I've seen these types before with Essence. Only the ones that I showed you just before. Oh, 
I love this. This is so beautiful. This is the rose collection from L'Oreal. Um, so it comes like this in a big sleeve and then it has my name there, which is really cute. Underneath you have the rose lipsticks and nail polishes. I'm not sure if you're aware, but L'Oreal came out with a nudes and a reds range, which were colors created by all the L'Oreal ambassadors, which have obviously different skin tones and complexions and things like that. So there should be a color to match each complexion. So the perfect color for you, in this case, the perfect pink or the perfect rose. I actually have been using this one so that's why it's not there and I didn't put it back because I was naughty but I think I used it in my everyday drugstore makeup routine if you want to go have a look at that I'm wearing it there it's a beautiful peachy nude color so five lipsticks and five nail polishes I'll do some swatches and close-ups of them for you so you can see what they're like and I really do like these little nail polishes because when are you gonna use a whole nail polish? Shout out to my girl Sophie at Priceline who has hooked me up with heaps of models prefer goodies. They have recently launched a new hair care range and so I have some conditioner, shampoo and uh, treatment treatments to try out. So we have shampoo and conditioner with argan oil, blonde bombshell shampoo and conditioner with argan oil, brighten and tone blonde color treated hair. Then we have two things here. We have the heat protective spray and we have a leave-in conditioner. And I actually got an oil as well, but I have used it just once and it left my hair feeling really nice and shiny. But the great thing about this range is everything is under $10, literally under $10. Like I cannot believe it. So affordable. I haven't yet tried the range apart from the once using the argan oil stuff but it's great that more more companies are coming out with like the purple colored shampoo and conditioner and everything like that i know when i was blonde the only like there were a few around but like it's great that there's more variety and range now so thanks so much sophie she also sent me the models prefer contour collection ultimate highlighting and contour palette and i used it for the first time today i just used one of the shades are oh, a little bit of that one actually, but it's a cream contour kit. Already I like it so much better than the Australis ones. That one was just way too warm toned, whereas these ones are quite cool toned. Um, I found them quite easy to blend, uh, but I need to have a proper go at this because I've never done the whole cream contouring thing. And the packaging is really, really good quality, very sturdy, and it comes with a mirror as well, like a really decent sized mirror. So thank you so much, Sophie, for all my models prefer goodies. I actually have a few Colette goodies from Hush, which is a PR company. Uh, the first thing here is this clutch, and oh my god, I cannot stop obsessing over this clutch. It is so beautiful. It's a really nice beige color with some gold trimming, and the shape of it is quite unique as well. I feel like this is the perfect clutch right now, especially because phones are getting a bit bigger, so it it will definitely fit your phone like if like my hands are small but it will fit your phone if it's like a iPhone 6 plus or whatever it's a good size for that the other bag I've got is this one here and this is um, just like a really nice I don't know you could use it for going out or day wear kind of thing as well and you can also tuck away the strap um, so you can use it just as a clutch as well and the same the same with this one it has a chain inside but yeah it just looks like that and it's a really nice neutral tan color which will go with so many things and then I got a bunch of rings so I'll just do a close-up and show you like on my hands what they look like kind of thing and I also got this cuff but I don't know if it will fit me like I tried getting it on me and then I was scared that it was gonna get stuck so I just kind of left it off <laughs> but I really like the look of these and then lastly I got a whole bunch of mud products from Viv at the heat group as well thank you so much Viv you have spoiled me completely if you didn't know where mud is from it's actually from Woolworths so you may have seen it before but not realize where it's from and it has super super affordable products so here we have the perfecting primer is $10 we have two of their nail polishes, which are $3 each. That's so affordable. And I love that they're like really nice neutral colors. I have brow pencils in blonde and brunette, and these ones are six dollars each and then we have a little eyeshadow palette and this one looks so pretty I actually showed it to a lady at work when I got it in the mail and she she went out and bought it straight away this one is twelve dollars and I haven't even opened it yet but the colors are quite pigmented and the other thing is they're all shimmery but they look stunning really really gorgeous so thanks so much Viv and thanks so much to all of the brands who sent me this stuff to share with you guys really excited to try so many things out which is 
just awesome. I love that makeup has come leaps and bounds from, you know, even when I first started YouTube three years ago, like people are constantly bringing out new products and going with new trends and colors and it's so exciting. It's such an exciting time for makeup. So I'm happy to share all of this new stuff with you guys. And that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.